First thing I want to speak about is the dithering and bouncing to disc. Whenever you're bouncing to disc and you, you start out with a 24-bit session, you're bouncing down 16, you always got to dither. Dithering it basically helps reduce the noise. It kind of like sets everything and quantizes it, improves the sound quality of your track. So when you're actually bouncing disc, make sure that on your master track that you have a dither on it. See my master track right here? Besides limiter, I was able to put a... Uh, dither on it by clicking on the multi-channel TDM plugin, clicking dither and power dither. Now once this is on, I can choose the bit setting, the bit resolution. Right now I have it on 16. Once this is set, I can go to my file, bounce the disk, and choose the settings that I want to bounce this. I can choose AIF, um, MPEG, WAVE, different things like that. Once I have that all set and I choose my resolution, which is 16 for the audio, for a CD, I click bounce, they'll ask me to name it, and I click OK, and it should bounce to whatever directory I choose. And this is the song that you can actually put to your CD and listen to in your car.